Welcome back to another video. Today we'll be unboxing and doing a initial review of the Bessus Capacitive Stylus Touch Pen. This particular unit you can actually get online for about six to seven US dollars. And what is uh, special about this is that uh, it makes your phone or tablet. Uh, becomes a, a well sort of a pen supported one again this is about six to seven us dollars you can get online it's a let me see if i can get it focused capacity capacity stylus with uh, a, a a pen as well which is replaceable uh, it uses a soft silicon tip and um, basic this is uh, this is some extra information uh, let's uh, have a look at the box uh, unboxing itself so you just pull it out from the bottom and uh, that's basically it so that's the stylus let me see if I can get it out there we go um, it's probably about 20 cm long so you'll fit directly into your pocket uh, with a pen clip uh, that you can hold it towards your pocket and um, the box itself um, it's not much I think there's an extra tip in here so that there is actually an extra uh, replacement tip uh, that you can replace with um, and uh, this tip if I can get closer or close enough uh, it's actually um, how do you say pivot you can actually pivot the, the tip uh, so this is silicon um, it actually mimics your fingerprint or your finger as it glides across the, the screen and the good thing about this particular silicon tip is that it's transparent so you can actually see where your middle point is uh, that like ma it mimics the center of your finger as you touch the screen um, that's how the capacitive uh, uh, screen actually works All right. so let me just put this away I'm just going to store this away for now so let's look at the the pen itself. Uh, there are two ends uh, with seems like it's uh, oh, it's screw screwable. All right. So the the side with um, I would think that these two caps are interchangeable. So as you wish, um, I suppose that this is actually mainly made as a um, digital stylus. So there is actually a rubber grip um, towards the stylus end. Um, so if you open the stylus end, you can see like this is uh, the tip. Now for capacitive screens, we cannot have a, a point stylus uh, because the screen will not register the touch. It needs to be like a finger uh, that you actually touch a small area and the center of the touch actually becomes the, the actual point of touch. So this stylus uh, tip, you can see, is actually round. Uh, I'd say probably about seven to eight mm, and okay. Oops, let me just show you. I'm just gonna move down so that uh, we'll start an app. So I'm just touching the screen with this. Um, so as uh, if I can do a new drawing. Let's say this. Okay. So you can see, like, um, although the surface is actually quite big, the actual registration of the touch is actually at the center of the stylus. Um, uh, it helps that because the um, circle is transparent you can actually see where your center point is so that is actually extremely useful let's see if I can um, get a um, dinner one how about this okay so let's uh, see if I can If you can see, I'm, go I'm going to try to zoom in a little bit more. Uh, it actually registers at the center 
of the silicon tip so I'm gonna just move it a bit closer so you can actually see it okay I'm gonna be slow so you can actually see you can actually see it actually registers at the very center of the silicon tip and the silicon tip actually being transparent is really really useful so let me just say, try to erase the see. okay so this is uh, it's quite good of course the uh, speed itself depends on your screen refresh I'm gonna try to move it a bit closer so you can actually see it. so uh, depending it doesn't matter which angle you write at because the tip can actually pivot right like this it will rotate and pivot so even if you write it at a very low angle okay let's see again So even at a very low angle, you can actually see that it pivots and this is uh, really useful, right? So uh, this would help um, with applications that support handwriting. Uh, like if you want to write certain special characters or, uh, you know, go use Google Translate for script-based languages, um, a stylus like this uh, is plenty useful. Uh, as well as uh, if you're doing digital art and your screen doesn't have an active stylus support uh, this will be a very uh, much better replacement for versus your finger um, and that's basically uh, how it works all right so let me just push this aside now um, I'm going to try to zoom out so I can get more of the pen that's the uh, digital stylus um, I'm just gonna cap this now on the other side uh, if you open the other side uh, it's also a screw top uh, it's actually a, a pen as well uh, this is of course uh, replaceable so let me just see how we can yeah so you just double screw it let's see right so I don't exactly know um, what kind of replacement cartridge you can buy or what brand this is um, but I think this is fairly standard one that you can uh, just look online I will try to find it and put in the comments below um, so let me just put this thing back there and uh, when it's new, it actually comes sealed with uh, some wax on top to prevent the tip from drying out. Okay. Now there's uh, again I was just saying that uh, on the stylus tip you have actually a rubber grip um, to actually help you uh, grip the pen a bit better. Now um, I would say uh, for the price of six to seven US dollars. Um, this is actually a very good buy. It's something that uh, you may want to look at.